jobs is such a fantastic opportunity to get direct access to multinational companies that are here in Ireland. I liked a lot of companies that were talking today and I just wanted to find out more about what they actually did. It's always good to kind of get information on, on the different things that are going on and, and even what's going on in the economy or what's going on in the different sectors at the moment. I'm coming towards the end of my PhD, I've got about six months left and I have an idea of what I want to do for my career but I figured if I came here I might meet some interesting people and see things or consider things that hadn't really been options beforehand. The guy here for Illusion next year was interesting to talk to. I'm a fan of magic myself so it's kind of great to be able to kind of like have someone with a similar interest to me. This is my third time here at Cool Jobs. Um, Google thinks it's really important that students get a bit of perspective on what comes after college. Google I thought would be more coding, but then after finding out they have a lot of jobs in engineering um, for data centers, and I found out with a lot of other companies I didn't know of. You always hear about the big company stuff, but some of the smaller ones here, uh, it's good to hear that people are actually making jobs themselves and like finding niches in markets. When I was a student in college, I had no idea really what I would end up doing. I didn't even know what direction I wanted to take. I think this gives people a chance to talk to people who have been out of college a few years, uh, have made those initial choices and can make you know, recommendations on was it a good idea or not. Not everyone who does computer science is going to be a computer programmer. Not everyone who does mechanical engineering is going to end up in engineering. It's nice to talk to like Deloitte and see that they're looking for data analysts and you're like, hey, I'm doing a PhD in chemistry. I do that all the time, <laughs> you know? So it was nice to, to just really see that my skills are really transferable. We look very much at science subjects so such as chemistry, physics, which I think people, students don't realise that Intel is interested in that type of uh, background, but also is that chemical engineering, mechanical engineering, and then also we have got our design side, so it's computer science, computer engineering as well. I graduated with a degree in biochemistry and I have a master's in biotechnology. Now knowing that they're actually taking on, that they're willing to take on science, like people with more scientific backgrounds, because I wasn't even thinking of applying to these companies because I didn't even think that I had a chance. So yeah, that was really good. When you hear it for the companies themselves, you kind of didn't know what to tailor your CVs or tailor your, your, your different kind of uh, pitches for rather than you know, if you look up on the internet and all that, it's kind of, um, you don't get it first hand. I found that the students were very well engaged with the questions. Um, some of them didn't really know what they wanted to ask, and some of them had like definite ideas of what they wanted to ask, so it was very interesting, yeah. I think it's really good to get an insight into almost like the day in the life. Like when you read a job description, you don't get that feedback. Something like this that's interactive, you can ask the question, what is your job really like? Or why did you study chemistry? Or why are you at Intel? And I think that's why something like this is really good, this kind of interactive element. Uh, C. Ditton was very good, getting the chance to talk to them one-to-one, -one, find out more what they like, what they don't like, what we should do as students, so yeah, very good. It was nice to talk to the Science Gallery and to learn that CRAN had an outreach program, which would be something that I'd be really interested in doing. Well really what we want them to think about is think about their future career, to think about like science and technology and, and to go, right, I don't have to be narrow or like, narrow and focus on one particular area. I think it's important to showcase the innovative and entrepreneurial aspects of jobs, particularly jobs that are seen to be, I suppose, more traditional professionals, maybe a little bit more mundane, um, but they actually have really interesting aspects to them. It's a fantastic opportunity for us to get out there, get networking and hopefully get some brilliant grads to come join us. I, lo I love hearing people talk about what they do. I thought that was amazing. Give it a go. <laughs> Absolutely. I'll fire up CVs to everyone and see what happens. Yeah.